Right here I have this 72 piece craft magnet set. I'm gonna go ahead and open this up, show you everything it comes with and how I'm going to use it. This was everything that came inside the package. You can see we have all of these clear glass cabochons, I think is what you call them, but they're basically like a marble that's in half. So you can see this is what they look like. You can see it's a little bit rounded on one side and then flat on the back, and then they're just clear just like that. And as you can see here, we actually have three different sizes. So we have a small, a medium, and a large size. Just for your own size reference, this one is 0.8 inches, this is one inch, and this is 1.2 inch across. So I do like the nice variety that we have there. And then what we have right here is these are three different magnet sheets that are cut out to the exact size of these glass pieces right here. So you can see you can easily just pop these little magnet pieces out and there's adhesive on one side of them. So the idea is when you completely assemble your little craft magnet, you're gonna have this glossy front here. You're gonna have the adhesive layer next and then the magnet down on the back. And the cool thing is, is you can stick anything that you want onto the back of these magnets. You can paint the back of them I've seen that done that's really cool you can put a sticker on the back of them you can decoupage some fabric or some decorated paper on the back there's just so many different things you can do with this but just to have the magnet already cut out to the exact size and have the little adhesive piece on that that's gonna make this craft so much easier I'm gonna go ahead and get this little craft set up and then I'll go ahead and show you what it's gonna look like when I use them all right, I'm ready to start out this little project. I do wanna note there are so many different projects you can do with this and so many different ways you can do with this. This is just the way that I am doing it this time. So I'm just gonna start with this large size one right here. You can see this little clear marble right here. And I'm just gonna be using clear kids glue here. I'm sure you can use any kind. I just opted for the clear one. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna put a little bit of clear glue right down here and just kind of get it around the entire surface. And you can use a little paintbrush to paint it on if you'd like. Just to make sure you have kind of a nice even coating of this clear glue. And you can put so many different things on here. You, you can put a heart-shaped piece of paper. You can put a design on top of a piece of paper, glue that together, and then glue it on here. Honestly, there are so many options here. I'm just gonna be using these little glitter sparkly pieces. I'm just gonna arrange them on here in the way that I think will look best. All right, now I'm just gonna make sure everything is definitely on there, it's not gonna fall off. All right, perfect. Now that I'm at this point, I'm just gonna let this fully dry before I stick this little adhesive magnet on there. So I'll check back in with you when this is fully dry. Okay, so as you can see here, the glue has completely dried these little sequins on here, and that looks exactly like I was hoping it would. So the only thing left to do is to take this little adhesive off of the magnet. And now I'm ready to stick these two together, and I'm just gonna push them nice and firmly. Okay, that looks so cute. I love the versatility of these craft supplies. You can do so many different things with them. I'm gonna go ahead and stick this on the fridge, but overall this is a really fun project, and I can't wait to do more of these.